So I just posted this video, the anime YouTuber tier list, and about 75 to 80 percent of the comments are, how could you possibly not know X YouTuber? How could you have not known about this guy? Well, I'm going to give you a quick rundown of exactly why. Exhibit A, my subscriptions page. You see this bookmarks bar? When I click on the YouTube button, it takes me to my subscriptions page. This is the only way in which I browse YouTube for the most part. Now I could go to the home page, but the home page doesn't recommend me any anime YouTubers. It's pretty much exclusively about music and just general YouTube shit. Why? Because I don't really watch that many anti-tubers outside of the ones I'm subbed to. The only way I really find out about new channels is if somebody links me a video, which nobody seems to do anymore. So, that's Exhibit A. Exhibit B, every YouTube video featuring Digibro. There are 3,200 videos in this playlist. A lot of them are long as fuck. When you're making videos, you can't watch videos. Keep myself pretty fucking busy. Exhibit C. This is my fiance Pantsu Party's Twitter. As you can see, we go out and do things like get kung fu tea and eat octopus bites. And uh, there should be a concert in here somewhere. I guess there's no pictures from it. Anyway, spending time with her is more interesting than watching YouTube videos. Next, Exhibit C, Exhibit D. One of these guys' channels that I didn't know about. Does any of this look like a video you would ever imagine me clicking on? First of all, it's all got obnoxious text on the screen, which for me is right away a signal to not click on something. Second of all, it's all shonen. I'm not really that huge into shonen. Sure, I like Hunter Hunter, but I already know what's good about Hunter Hunter. I don't need to watch this guy talk about it. None of this looks like anything I would ever click on in my life. Finally, Exhibit E. The fact that a lot of these motherfuckers have changed their avatars. Like, I love Little Karibo. He probably would have gone in A or S tier. Why would I have thought this was Little Karibo's avatar? When I used to watch him, he had a Little Karibo for an avatar. So, as far as I'm concerned, this this is completely unrecognizable. Uh, I also would have maybe recognized something witty entertainment, but I'd, I've never actually watched more than like half an episode of SAO Abridged. Uh, I, 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 as I clarified in the video, I did know Team Four Star. I've just never watched any of their videos. You know, some of these are just people I've never seen or not seen enough of. So people were like, how do you not know, uh, say, Lost Paws? Well, like, do you think I would watch one? Why would I? No, this is just not stuff I would watch. So there you go. There's your rundown. That's why I don't know the Annie Tubers.